Hey guys, what's up? Lord Meacher again here, your lord of video games, and welcome to another episode of Persona 3 Portable. In the last episode, we finally made a decision on what to do, and we also spent New Year's together with our friends. So, today we're continuing right where we left off. As I told you guys, it is evening because... There was absolutely nothing to do during the day, so what I just did is go to the shrine, pray, get Fuka, uh, I don't know, get her more. Um, we are going to talk with Koromara and see. I'm just looking at, yes, let's go for a walk. Hmm? Someone's coming this way. <laughs> meet your kun, we meet again. Meeting you randomly like this, it's a nice change of pace. You talked for a while. So we seem closer now. They decided to go back to the dorm of Koromaru. Good boy. Alright, you are no longer in great condition. Dang it. Winter vacation continues. Yeah. This is gonna suck. Because this is just winter vacation. You turned on the TV. An entertainingly catchy song comes from the speakers. Here comes Tanaka. Over the airwaves to you. The home shopping show is evidently about to start. Today's item is... You won't be safe without this. Four salvation badges. One for every member of the household. But wait. We'll also provide a set of four disaster-proof backpacks. Now, how much would you pay? You may be surprised to learn that it's only 29,800 yen. Await the apocalypse with no worries. Oh, what's this? I'm hearing sad voices. I'm hearing the phones ringing off the hook. They're already completely sold out, 100%. Sorry, folks, but when it's gone, it's gone. We'll see you next Sunday, same time, same channel. The hideously catchy song begins to play. Here comes Tanaka over the airwaves to you. The home shopping program is over. You turned off the TV. Well, that was rude. I didn't even get to buy anything. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, well. Time to head for the Naganaki Shrine. Who are you? Okay. And obviously, pray. No, I'm kidding. Akinari. <sighs> hey, can you spare a few minutes? There's something important I want to tell you. I must warn you, though. It's a little depressing. Seems there's something he wants to talk about. Since you have the sun persona, Yagra Garasu, you might be able to become even closer. Would you like to talk with him for a while? Yes. Thank you. Akinari seems happy. I've been waiting. I finished my story and wanted to show it to you. Akinari wears a calm smile. As you know, I was having a lot of trouble with the ending, but finally figured it out. Since the alligator ate his friend, the bird, he cried and cried for a very long time. In fact, he was so sad that he drowned in his own tears. His tears became a beautiful lake, around which grew beautiful flowers and a tree with delicious fruit. The other animals in the forest came here, of, came there often to relax, but none of them knew that alligator had created it, or that he was gone. The end. Wow, that's the ending I decided on. Even though the alligator did not find meaning in his life, the residents of the forest did. They just didn't realize it. Because the meaning of my life is not something I should worry about. It's really what others think of my life or what I was able to do for them. So, for me, or you, or anyone, the meaning of our lives is something that we make but don't see. People can't survive without help from others. We all depend on one another. That's deep. I don't know if that made sense, but do you kind of get what I'm saying? Yeah, 
I understand. I'm glad. This is the notebook I wrote my story in. It's all I have to leave behind. I wanted you to have something since you shared my last moments. Obtain worn notebook. Akinari stood up. My body feels lighter. Thank you for everything. I mean, to see me talking, even discussing the meaning of life. I, I can be glad that I was born. You understand Akinari's kindness. Our relationship is stronger now. Oh, I'm choking up. Oh my god. <sighs> Max rank. Dying young man. Oh, Akinari. I will always remember you. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thus establish a genuine bond. The innermost power of the Sun Arcana have been set free. We bestow upon thee the ability to create Azura, the ultimate form of the Sun Arcana. <clears throat> the dying young man social link has reached its maximum level. You have mastered the dying man young man social link. Your power to create persona of the Sun Arcana has reached its maximum. Mitsuru Miyake has forged a bond that cannot be broken. <sighs> the Sun Social Link is at its maximum level. You can now create Azura, the Grand Being. I have to go now. Mitsuru. Maybe. Someday. I hope. We meet again. What? Akinari disappeared into the afternoon sunlight? Huh? He gripped his notebook tightly. Oh, and decided to head back to the dorm. Oh, I guess he just walked away. Okay. Accepted. Ah, <sighs> not much. Sad. Just sad. Ah! Karmars are looking at you pleadingly. Yes, let's go for walkies. Kromar is frolicking happily. Kromar picked something up. Obtain Trafuri gem. Yes, that's good. Decide to go back to the dorm of Koromaru. Monday! Winter vacation will be over soon. Oh, really? Already? Who's calling? There can only be like three people. Phone is ringing. Hi, it's me. Do you have time to talk? Yeah. Would you like to do something today? Since you have the Empress Persona locks me, you might be able to become even closer. What should you do? Accept the offer. Excellent. I shall be waiting outside. <clears throat> Mitsuru seems excited. All right, let's go on a date. Polonia Mall, Chagall Cafe. What a pleasant aroma. I only drink tea at home, so I don't know which type of coffee is considered good. But I seem to have taken a liking to this one. Uh, Mitsuru, might I suggest in the future, um, I don't know how long, maybe 10 years, we go to a cafe called Cafe Le Blanc. It's gonna be a little bit of a distance, but I... I heard the coffee is gonna be really good. Hmm? What are you talking about, Minato kun? Um, just, I don't know. I have this feeling like this cafe called that is gonna be really good. Hmm, well, if you say so, I'll check it out definitely with you. It sure seems to be enjoying herself. <clears throat> By the way, do you remember what I said the other day? About being hesitant to see you. Mitsuru seems nervous. Well, even though that's what I said, I found myself with you once again. To be honest, I don't know what I'm doing. What is it that I'm feeling for you? Ah. Uh, it's love, baby. As I told you before, I have a fiancé and my marriage has been arranged. I'll never forgive you for saying that. Oh, sorry. Mixer looks angry. 
Today you learned something new about her. My apologies. Recall that you have something you can give as a present. Yes, give present. What kind of present should you give? Uh, let me see what else things she likes. Uh, gifts, Mitsuru likes. Best gifts for Mitsuru, okay. Uh, can you tell me? Banana cupcake, chocolate. Chocolate truffle, Google eye idol. Google eyed idol, really? Google eyed, I, you're kidding. I swear, if you're trolling me, I will be very upset. This is for me? I'm impressed with your choice. Oh! I had no idea you knew me so well. Thank you. It's been a long time since I've received a present that has resonated with me like this. It just needs to be delighted with the gift. Uh, okay, it's getting dark out. It's like I go back to the dorm. The internet did not lie to me for once. Oh, hey. Hey. Have you noticed those weird symbols and posters all over town? They really creep me out. This must be affecting everyone's mind. We should go to Tartarus. My mom's gonna totally fly by, you know? Wait, what? What are you talking about? Everybody's here. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I see. Oh, let me get my reward. I never got my reward. You're here. Take this envelope. That, that's a token of gratitude from the missing housewife left with us. You rescued her, right? Don't ask questions. Just take it. Take diamond. Ooh, they... I, I came in a good day, but uh, we already have everything. So thank you, officer. Oh, wow. Uh, let's just go back. The dorm. Oh, wow. It's everywhere. It says Nyx. Oh, boy. Let's sleep it out. Go to bed early. Yes. Tuesday. Oh, Friday, school starts again. Perfect. Winter vacation will be over soon. Who's calling? Phone is ringing. Hello, this is Fuka. Do you have a minute? Um. I mean, we might as well, right? Sure. Um, I was wondering if you'd like to go out someplace with me today. So they have the priestess persona Kikurihime. You might be able to become even closer. What should you do? Accept the offer. Well, let's check the social link. Rank 8. Alright. If only, like, she could level like this. I wish. Accept the social link. Great. Then I'll be waiting outside of the dorm. Luca seems excited. Polonium all power records. You're having a good time with Fuka. Oh, there's the soundtrack I was looking for. Well, that was easy. I couldn't seem to find it anywhere online. The store isn't very big, but they seem to carry a lot of hard to find CDs. Fuka seems to be enjoying her day off. Um, there's something I've been wanting to talk with you about. Fuka seems to be thinking about something. Just like there is a connection between sight and taste. You think there's a connection between sound and taste? What? Like when you hear steak sizzling on a frying pan. Did I just misread that or? So do you think there's any way to connect music to cooking? I think that was a typo. Yeah, I think so. You do? Really? Oh, I'm so excited now. Maybe I should do some research on it. Luca seems happy. You came in a lot closer with Fuka today. Recall that you have a present you can give her. Let me see. Uh, gifts. Fuka likes. P3P. All right, let's see. 
brand purse. Oh, she likes a brand purse? Uh, I don't know if I have any. Other. Mm, does she like any Lucky Charm, Ganesha, or Jack Frost doll? She likes a brand watch. Oh, Ganesha Bank. She likes that. All right, well, here you go. This is for me. You seem to know my taste. Thank you very much. Look, I really like... Seems to really like the present. It's getting dark out. I decide to go back to the dorm. All right. Hey, Koromaru. You want walkies? He's tilting his head. He's not in the mood for a walk. Well, back to the room. This is just going to be everything that we're doing right now. Go to bed early? Yes. Wednesday. And your vacation will be over soon. And there's only two people that can call me. Your phone is ringing. Hey, it's me, Kaz. You got a minute? Sorry, I'm busy. Really? All right, later then. Zushi hung up. He seems disappointed. Sorry, I'm just like... I'm gonna pass these days. Let me see, um... Port Island Station, how it looks. Oh my god. Jesus. Station outskirts. Kitty's okay. Town map. The strip mall. Jeez. Graffiti's everywhere. Town map. And let's go to the Naganaki Shrine. There's posters here too. Do not desecrate the sacred grounds of the shrine. That's uh female classmate, Fuka. Closer to Fuka. Oh great. We're gonna have bad luck. Welcome back. We should go to Tartarus tonight. Our goal now is to reach the top of Tartarus. We cannot falter. Not now. We have to do all that we can. Not today. <sighs> Not today. Let's sleep. Today's the last day of winter vacation. Okay, no calls. Perfect. I can go to town. Naganaki Shrine. Pass the time with this. Yeah, female classmate, Fuka. Thousand yen, good. Do, do all these, like, go forward? Like, you know, like, keep going forward and, like, what's it called? Um, let's walk a Koromaru, can Okay. All right. I just can go with you tonight. Perfect. Go together. Ruff, ruff, ruff. Uh, Koromaru-san looks very happy. School will start again tomorrow. I'm actually looking forward to it. Everything seems so different now. If you wouldn't mind, perhaps we could walk home together after classes tomorrow. Oh. Oh? I'd like to see the town with you, Michiru-san. You spoke of Igus for a while. <laughs> His Karamaru's done playing. Welcome back. Mm. You're hungry. Well, I will give you a small snack when we return. Just a little one, okay? You decide to go back to the dorm of Koromaru. It's Friday, finally! It's the beginning of the third semester. You overhear a conversation. Hey, have you heard of this cult? Hey. Don't call it that. You don't know anything about it. The fall is coming. It's already decided. 
Oh well, if it's already decided, then it can't be helped. What? By the way, about homework for second period. First bell has wrong. Uh oh. This does not look good. Happy New Year, everyone. Winter break is over now. No more booze. You guys are underage. I feel sorry for you. Well, let's get right down to business. It's a new year, so we'll start with the basics. Simple concept, but students often get it wrong. I'm talking about the apostrophe. Okay, meet you. With three phrases I've written on the blackboard, tell me which one is correct. It's wrong. It's absolutely right. It's is a contradiction of it, it is. It's is a possessive word. You could say it's tail or it's temperature, but not it's wrong. Mm -hmm. There's another pair of words that are commonly confused. There and, and there have the same pronunciation, but they're not interchangeable, so watch out. Now, open your textbooks. Get the correct answer. Your charm has increased. Thank you, thank you. Hey, uh, you busy? No, what's up? Your face started talking to you. Could you come with me for a sec? What's up? Okay. Let's go to the rooftop. All right, what's up? The rooftop. No one is around except for you and Junpei. Hey, we've really never had a chance to talk, have we? Nope. It's almost coming of age day, you know? Mm-hmm. I used to just think of it as a day off. But now, I wonder if I'm even going to live long enough to celebrate it. Of course you will. You worry too much. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. It's been pretty weird around here lately. Tell me about it. People have been passing out. Others have gone missing. Dude, it's crazy. We really have to end this. Senpai said it's because there are too many shadow victims and the memory revision can't keep up. It's all got to be because of this Nyx. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Oh, and have you heard about that doomsday cult? Yeah. They've been running around town telling everyone they see that the end of the world is coming. Man, we need to do something. And quick. We do. I agree. But it's not just Nyx, you know. Two members of Strega are still alive. Right. They haven't done anything yet. But I know they've got to be planning something. Mm-hmm. And we need to take care of them, too. I agree. Wow. I'm such good friends that I trust you with my life. Hey, I trust you with mine as well. <laughs> I never would have imagined that happening last spring. No, uh, you were kind of a dick. <laughs> but then again, I never thought it would come to this. Yeah. Junpei is looking far off in the distance. Hey, uh, by the way, are you going out with Buka? Uh, what? <laughs> no worries. That's cool with me. I'm... Not. Fuka's a great girl. Treat her right. I will. But, oh. You know, I don't think it's completely hit me yet. It's just all so hard to believe. But that doesn't mean we should just sit around and wait for it to happen. Yeah. You're pretty cool, man. Hey, so are you. That thing was inside you for ten years. And you harnessed its power and made it your own. Mm-hmm. Junpei turned to face you. I know I've run my mouth a lot since the day we met. It's cool. It's all water under the bridge. But I'm totally serious when I tell you. I'd trust you with my life. So would I. I'm... I'm glad to know you. Glad to know you as well, my it's friend. It's embarrassing to say it, but... But that's really how I feel. We'll always be friends, right? I mean, even after this is all over? We will. Of course. <laughs> Exchange a firm handshake with Junpei. Class is ended for today. Um, I guess said she wanted to walk home. Meet you, son. It's been a long time since I first came to school. My outlook on many things has changed. But I'm not sure these changes are for the best. Meet you, son. Do you have any plans after school? Let's out. If it's all right with you, I would like to walk home with you. Of course. I'm glad to hear that. But, okay, oh, but there is one place I would like to visit before returning to the dorm. 
Shall we go? Of course. Naganaki Shrine. I come here a lot lately. Oh, so I can start the social link. Before, I couldn't understand the benefits of coming to these places called shrines. But lately, that has changed. This is also where we met Koromaru-san last summer. We, we waited here until we found him, even though he knew his master had died. Now, I can understand his reasons for doing that. What drives people isn't necessarily facts, but feelings. He knew for a fact that his master had died, but his feelings of wanting to be with him made him stay. It's the same for me. I have grasped the fact that I can't protect you, yet here I remain. Subconsciously, I was following my feelings rather than the available data. I was so confused at the time that I didn't notice it, but to tell the truth, it seems that the reasons behind my behavior changing while I am with you, Michiru-san. Seems you sense a faint affection from Aegis. Here we go. She has to be... Eon? Because that's the one I just got by mistake. Thou art I and I am thou. Let's establish a new bond. Thou shalt be blessed when creating personas of the Eon Arcana. Yep. I was fusing things and suddenly created Eon, and I'm like, well, I'm keeping this. This might be Igus. I've established an Igus social link of the Eon Arcana. Yep. You may earn XP bonus from fusing Persona of the Eon Arcana. That's why I didn't, like, give me anything. It seems this is a new Arcana, the Eon social link. Oh, I have a correction to make. I talked about what drives people. But, of course, Koromaru-san and myself aren't people. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just look somewhat lonely. Hey, don't worry. I decided to go back to the dorm. Don't worry about that, girl. Where have you been? Hanging out with Igus. This term seems like any other term. I don't care about what's going to happen to the world. What I'm going to do is keep moving forward. Let me know when you want to go to Tartarus. I will. And Kuromar's not available, so... Our room. Sleep. Let's pass to Saturday. Class is ended for the day. Oh, I can hang out with her again. Uh, Mitsuru available? Yes, yeah, she is. Miyake, <laughs> what a coincidence. Are you leaving now? Mitsuru seems to be curious how you would re you will react. Since you have the Empress Persona locks me, you might be able to become even closer. Would you like to spend some time with her after school? Yeah, let's go. Okay, then let's go. It's rare that I have any free time. Mitsuru is smiling. This should be rank 7, right? That's why I strip mall. Wild Duck Burger. Back here again? <laughs> I think I've acquired a taste for fast food. Do you remember when I said that I was hesitant to meet with you like this? Oh, we're doing this again? Well, could you just pretend you never heard that? We both sleep under the same roof. There's no point in worrying about it. <clears throat> and... I should confirm my decision. There's a melancholy tone. Melancholy tone to Mitsuru's voice. Hey, Miyake? Do you want to see how many places we can visit in one day? Or is that being selfish? Let's do it! Oh, <laughs> glad to hear that. Let's visit all the restaurants you introduced me to, in order. I can go anywhere now, as long as you're with me. It's her smiling. Thank you, Miyake. Let's make some memories that will last forever. I can certainly make my decision after I had some fun. I hope. You understand how Mitsuru feels, do we? The relationship is stronger now. Do we, though? Mitsuru Kirijo Social Link, rank 7. The Mitsuru Kirijo Social Link has reached level 7. 
The power to create personas of the Empress Arcana has grown. Seems like things are getting serious with Mitsuru. You spend time with Mitsuru until you, just before curfew, and then you return to the dorm. Sup, dude? Yep. Like three more weeks till X day. It's weird. I was pissing my pants all last month. Since I decided that I was gonna fight, I'm not scared anymore. Hey, let's go to Tartarus, man. Gotta do what we can do, right? In a later date. Romaru? Romaru's <laughs> looking at you pleadingly. Alright, let's go for walkies. <laughs> hmm? What's coming this way? Oh, it's you, Michiru san. And Koromaru kun, too. Uh, if it's alright, I'm getting used to him little by little. I just have to keep telling myself Koromaru kun would never fight. You talked for a while. You two seem closer now. I decided to go back to the dorm of Koromaru. You're no longer in great condition. There's no school today. No, it's Sunday. Who's calling? Hey, it's me, Kaz. Got a minute? Sorry, I'm busy, my man. Oh, really? Alright, later then. Kazushi hung up. He seemed disappointed. Hmm. Alright, Sunday. We already finished. Um, let's go to... I guess the Naganaki Shrine. And, uh... Let's draw a fortune. Well, Fuka. Today's luck is, you will have the very worst luck. Oh no. My condition worsened. Hi, how was your day? It was good. Thank you, Fuka. Koromaru? <laughs> Koromaru's looking at you pleadingly. Let's go for a walk. Again, alright. <laughs> Koromaru's frolicking happily. Koromaru picks something up. I'm saying Trafuri gem. We're getting a lot of Trafuri gems. We decide to go back to the dorm of Koromaru. We're breezing through these days. Oh, it's day off. Uh, today is coming of age. There's no school. Oh, uh, bay. Oh, boy. You're tired. You don't seem to be feeling well. I guess let's do the same thing. Naganaki Shrine. That's uh, a female classmate, Fuka. Come on, and close to his luck, and you will have bad luck. Oh, come on. Uh. Hello. Today's coming of age day. I don't want my life to end before I become an adult. Hey, let's go to Tartarus tonight. I want to see the world end. Okay, I understand. Nope, not in the mood for walkies. All right. All right, let's rest in our room to improve our condition. You're tired. You don't seem to be feeling well. Yes. Let's go to bed. It's Tuesday. Over here, a conversation. Lately, even the late night comedy shows have been talking about the end of the world. Feels creepy. Hey, are you still talking about that? By the way, I wanted to show you this magazine that hit the stands today. Magazine? Don't tell me it's about cults. Well, just read it for yourself. You'll see how true it really is. Oh my god, the first bell has rung. My lord. Finally time for lunch. Oh? Yeah, okay. What's wrong? But I'm not disturbing you. I was wondering if you're free after school today. I'd like us to spend some time together, if it's not too inconvenient for you. It sort of seems to have something to talk to you about. Maybe you should spend some time with her after school. Sure. Lunch break is almost over. You decide to return to your classroom. <sighs> it's cold. I should have... 
I should have my skin plated. I shine as bright as the sun. Y'all know what plating is, right? It's a process to cover objects in thin metallic layer. Thin plating is done by plating iron with tin. For corru corrugated galvanized iron, you plate iron with zinc. Gold metals, by the way, are created by plating silver with gold. So technically, Olympic athletes don't win gold medals. It's kind of sad. You feel tired. Close your eyes for a few minutes. Uh, this doze off to improve our condition. Your conscience drifts as you close your eyes. Start to feel better. Your condition is great now. There we go. Class is ended for today. Mitsuru wanted to spend some time. Okay, so I guess it's not available always. I have to balance this out very well. Hey, senpai. Miyake, what a coincidence. Are you leaving now? Mitsuru seems to be curious how you will react. Since you have the Empress Persona locks me, you might be able to become even closer. Would you like to spend some time with her after school? Yes, we do. Okay, then let's go. It's rare that I have any free time. It's her smiling. Port Island Station, movie theater. We had a fun time with Mitsuru. I've been wanting to see that movie for a long time. It was very entertaining. Even though it was a typical road trip movie, the way the characters express their emotions was great. I mean, character sacrificed everything just to go on a journey with his friends. And then, in the final scene, he decided to return to his normal life. I wonder if he was happy with that decision. Hey, Miyake? Have you ever thought about going to a place like that? Somewhere far away where no one knows who you are? Yes. Yes, I do. Yes, I have. Really? I'm surprised to hear that. I didn't know you felt that way. Mitsuru is forcing a smile. Don't misunderstand me. I don't yearn to leave everything behind. It's just that sometimes it's easy to become bound by the things that are important to you. The future of the company, all my responsibilities. I wish I didn't have so much to worry about. Sometimes I feel shackled by my family name. <laughs> However... I know that kind of thinking is not permitted. <laughs> I've been complaining. Become so undisciplined, constantly complaining. <laughs> I must bore you of all my griping. This year seems to trust you. Your relationship has grown closer. That's rank eight, right? Yep. All right, we're almost done. Two more times with Mitsuru Senpai, and we're done. Buka just needs two more, I think. The Mitsuru Kirijo social link has reached level eight. Your power to create personas the Empress Arcana has grown. Your relationship has grown closer. There's something I want to ask you. Now, hypothetically, what would you think if I told you that I am interested in someone? And even though I can never be with him, I can't stop thinking about him. Would that be... wrong? Hypothetically! No, I don't think so. Yeah, okay. Mitsu seems hurt. Oh. Sorry. Um Miyake. Am I There you are. Mitsuru Oh god This guy reminds me of someone and looking for you I expect to find you here We're leaving Let's go Wait a minute, I didn't make any plans with you for today. My business meeting for this evening was cancelled. I'm a very busy man. You're just going to have to adjust your schedule to mine. I think she's more important than you! I can't. I've already made plans. We can break them. I don't think you have anything more important to do than spend time with me. <sighs> you look so sullen. You know this benefits you as well, don't you? Well, you understood our arrangement. No. No. 
You're to be my wife, and you're to be obedient. <sighs> How must you and your family always be so difficult? Well, at least your father is no longer alive. I am relieved at that. What the? Imagine you feel the same. How? How could you say that? It's just trembling with anger. I'm gonna say something to you. Listen here, buddy. The fuck you think you are? Yeah, okay. It sure seems happy. Who the hell are you? Oh, that's none of your business. It's none of your business. Get lost. Well, actually, it is my business. She is my business. Listen, Mitsuru. Corporate management is not child's play. No matter how smart you are, you're still going to need my knowledge and experience. The Kirijo group still needs the cooperation of my company, does it not? Yes. Good girl, Mitsuru. I knew you would listen to reason. Now, let's go. I'm gonna reservations for us at a luxurious restaurant. Very well. Mitsuru. I wish you hadn't seen that. Oh, thank you. I had a lot of fun today. And I'm sorry. Please excuse me. Mitsuru is leaving. What will you do? Mm, ah, I don't know. <sighs> Grab her fiance and hand me your barbarian. This is assault. I've been injured in any way. Mitra is the only the one who will be forced to pay the price. God damn it. I chose wrong. Mitra is looking at you with surprise. You should know your place in society. An ordinary person like you is not fit to interact with people like Mitsuru and myself. Don't you understand? You're just a nuisance. <laughs> Can't believe this. You continue to befriend derelicts like this, such as this M Mitsuru. Mitsuru's fiance continues to berate you. <laughs> that's enough. Mitsuru? I said that's enough. I won't let you insult him. Are you getting so angry? If you insult him, you insult me. Mitsuru? What are you talking about? How dare you say he should he should know his place? You can't even compare to him. He lives life on his own terms. He has taught me not to fear the future. I I want to be with him. Now. And forever. Oh. You want to be with him? Now and forever? What on earth are you talking about? You're my fiance. You think that I'm inferior to this hooligan? I suggest you retract that statement, Mitsuru. We'll only forgive you if you apologize to me this instance. Think about the future of your company. I will not apologize. I want to be with him. You don't care about me or how I feel. The Kirija group can stand on its own. You don't need any help from a person like you. From today, you and I are strangers. If you try to do anything malicious, I will use the power of the group to destroy you. Get out of here, you snob. I want to see your face ever again. Uh, Bobby! Bobby! <laughs> The well-dressed man ran away. Ooh. Oh my god. Um. Uh, I, I, uh. And she ran away. He sort of ran away. He decided to return to the dorm. <laughs> what the hell? Oh my god. When you returned to the dormitory, Junpei greeted you like he was waiting for you. Oh, there you are. Hey, what's up, my man? We're all going to uh, Hagakure. Want to come? Sure. Wow, that was easy. But <laughs> Akihiko-san's buying. You remember that bet we made in Yakushima? Yeah. Uh, you probably forgot all about it by now. No, I still remember. Well, you won in the end. Even if it was, I guess. 
<laughs> but whatever. Akihiko-san's still lost, right? Yep. It took me like six months to make him accept that fact. So come on, everyone else already left. We gotta hurry. All right, let's go. Ah, <sighs> Otai Strip Mall, Hagakure Ramen. Akihiko, Aikis, and Yukari are already standing there. Is the special okay for everyone? Hmm. Sounds good to okay. me. Five specials, please. Where's Mitsuru Senpai? Man, this is awesome. Akihiko san's never treated us all to ramen before. Hey, why do I have to treat everyone? Hey, you promised you lost the best. <laughs> Not this again. Come on, Akihiko san. A bet's a bet. Pay up. All right, all right. I never said I wouldn't. <laughs> What's wrong, I guess? You doubting me too? No, but have you seen the magazine on that counter? Hmm? There's an article in it that looks highly disturbing. Oh, is it the article we heard about? Which magazine? It's this one. Emergence of a Messiah. The charismatic one speaks. Huh, it must be about that doomsday cult. They're all over the internet, too. Hmm. Huh? Hey, look at the photo in this. Check out the so-called Messiah. Who? What? What the? I is that Takaya? Oh my god! I thought something was up. So, Streg is behind that cult. Of course. <sighs> I've lost my appetite. Listen to what he says. Mankind is currently imprisoned by the sins of hate and anger. But soon, a savior will descend upon this world to break the chains that bind us and lift us to new heights. This great being is Nyx. I have beheld her glory, and she has blessed me with power beyond belief. Oh, sure, she has. In Nyx, there is no pain, no suffering. How the hell does he know about Nyx? Mm -hmm. Wait, he's saying that Nyx will save the world? That's not true. I don't think he really means what he's saying. This is all just a game to him. Yeah. That son of a bitch. He'll get what's coming to him. But there are those who do not understand this truth, even though they have also been blessed by her. They have acquired the same power <coughs> as I, yet they abuse it, using it for their own personal gain. No, we do not. These miscreants are the ones to blame for the recent tragedies that have been plaguing our streets. Excuse me? Wait, is he talking about us? Yep. Shh, not so loud. Oh, sorry. Hey, what's up with them calling him the charismatic one? Mm. How'd he get so popular all of a sudden? Well, Jin's pretty well known on the internet. <coughs> He's probably pretty good at stirring up trouble. Yeah, I bet he orchestrated Takaya's rise to fame. Probably. <coughs> oh, those two make me sick. Brothers and sisters, I shall go forth to make preparations for Nyx's arrival. But do not fear those evildoers who desecrate their gifts. Nyx shall right their wrongs. May your hearts be filled with peace as you await your salvation. Blessed are those who take joy in the coming of Nyx. The revolution is here. Revolution? People can't <coughs> seriously be buying this crap, can they? Throughout history, those who have changed the future have often been highly charismatic. That's the end of the article. It appears that after the interview, Jin and Takaya disappeared again. Well, there's only one place they could have gone. Tartarus. They must have been planning this all along. Yeah. Takaya's words have changed the mood of the entire city. <coughs> Even though they won't admit it, they are all afraid. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, why else would people believe this nonsense Takai is preaching? They want something to cling to. Uh, I guess people just need something to believe in. Exactly. That's what I was thinking, but I just went with this, you know, wording. Well, no wonder there's a sense of doom in the air. We're all gonna die. Junpei. But is that so surprising? The fact that all life ends one day has nothing to do with Nyx. Death is a natural occurrence in the cycle of life. Don't all humans realize this? Mm. I guess. Yeah, but this is coming sooner than anything. To tell you the truth, I never even would have thought about my own death if none of this had happened. Yeah. But since we've made up our minds, why don't we just leave it at that? Our objective is Nyx. If Strega gets in our way, we'll just have to deal with them too. I agree. I agree. We'll probably run into them at Tartarus anyways. Mm -hmm. However you look at it, we're the obstacle standing in their way. The promised day will soon be here. Yeah. We need to do all we can until then. Yeah. All right. And if that's the case, we're going to need lots of energy. Let's eat. Right. Excuse me. I'd like to order a Hagakure bowl. You don't mind, do you, Akihiko-san? Junpei, don't forget, you're having half of Igus's food, too. Mm-hmm. Oh, don't worry. I'm starving. <laughs> you just better eat it all. <laughs> I love these dorks. All right. Nope. Let's go to our room. End the day. I want to make this episode a little bit longer. All right, Wednesday. Oh, it's finally time for lunch. Hello, Michiru san. Are you available after school? Hmm. For now? I see. Would you be interested in walking home together? I want to be beside you. Seems I guess would like to spend time with you after school. You may wish to talk to her once classes are over. Sure. Alright, the lunch break is almost over. You decide to return to your classroom. Let's go. Class is ended for today. Let's talk to her. Um, Michiru-san. I want to be by your side. I guess looking at directly into your eyes. Since you have the Eon Persona Uriel, you might be able to become even closer. Would you like to spend some time with Igus after school? Yes. Thank you very much. Shall we go? Does Igus progress, like, automatically as well? Gekko Khan High School Rooftop. Just wondering. I like this place. I can see the entire town from here. The Moonlight Bridge is to the right, and over there is Polonia Mall. Oh, and did you know you can also see our dorm from here? The ocean water at Yakushima, where I had been sleeping, were clearer than these. But I prefer the view here. Before I came here, things such as liking or disliking the scenery never entered my mind. <clears throat> What about you, Michiru-san? Do you like this town? I like it. I'm glad to hear that. Feeling the same way as we view the same scenery. It feels nice. I guess he's smiling. Many feelings towards various things I had not recognized before are making themselves clear now. It's a little scary sometimes. Uh, but if I can change by being with you, I want to hold on to this feeling. You sense faint affection for Igis from Igis. Rank two. The Igis social link has reached level two. We have 18 days to max all these. Oh my god. Your power to create personas, the A on Arcana, has grown. Oh, I'm sorry to have gone on for so long. It's still January, so I imagine you are quite cold. It would be awful if you caught a chill. You decide to go back to the dorm.
All right. Hi, how is your day? It's pretty good. It's already the middle of January. Since today is the 13th, we only have 18 more days. Let's go to Tartarus today. Even though I might be overdoing it, I still want to do as much as I can right now. Um... <clears throat> no. Tormar's looking at you pleadingly. Wants to go for a walk. Yes. I don't know why I like... <sighs> Someone's coming this way. Uh, good evening, Michiru-san. Oh, Chihiro again. <laughs> it's a little embarrassing to run into you at night. <sighs> but I think it helps me be a little braver. I'm, I'm not as old as you, and I might not be very reliable. But I think I could at least lend you a hand when you need one, Michiru-san. Please don't forget that. I will never do. Sorry if that was sudden. Things have gotten odd lately, so... <laughs> Maybe I just watch TV too much. You talked for a while. So we seem closer now. You decide to go back to the dorm of Koromaru. Thursday, you're no longer tired. So we're here, conversation. Got a flyer at Polonia Mall when I went last time. Same one that's been plastered all over the city. The one with the Nyx logo? Oh, so that's how it's pronounced. I just like the logo's design. The stuff written here is kind of interesting, too. Maybe we should ask them about it next time. First bell has rung. Please don't. Please don't. Do not. Finally, time for lunch. Who comes up? Miyake. Oh. What's wrong? I hope I'm not disturbing you. I was wondering if you're free after school today. I'd like us to spend some time together if it's not too inconvenient for you. Mitsuru seems to have something to talk to you about. Maybe you should spend some time with her after school. Yeah, totally. The lunch break is almost over. It is our return to your classroom. <clears throat> I'm making this episode especially long for you guys. <sighs> All right, let's go to. I do not want to go to the town. Uh, to the town map. Hi, Miyake. Um, there's something I want to talk to you about. I'm pretty sure you know what it's regarding. But I wanted to talk to you properly. We can talk later if you don't have the time now. Mitsuru's cheeks are turning red. As you have the Empress Persona locks me, you might be able to become even closer. Would you like to spend some time with her after school? Yes. Okay. Then, should we go to the rooftop? Mitsuru seems a bit nervous. Oh, to the rooftop? Gekokan High School? Rooftop. <clears throat> I don't think anyone will find, the, find us up here. Is my authority as student council president to make sure of it. It's the first time I've ever done anything like this, you know? <sighs> I don't care about that right now. What I want to say is... He sort of seems flustered. The, the thing is... I need to apologize to you. I'm sorry about what happened the other day. Hmm. That makes me happy, though, that you did that. Uh, really? Mitsuru seems very happy. All right, good. Ooh, the other day, I ran away after saying all those things up to you. I can't believe I did that. I'm so sorry. I've been planning to tell you how I felt. I just can't believe I said it in front of so many people. But that's not all. You've opened up a whole new world to me. A world full of happiness and surprises. I can't stop thinking about you. Miyake? Hmm? I... like you. Oh. Ooh, hearing the voice say that just hit me in my heart so hard. Oh. Oh. I feel like I'm going to die of embarrassment. 
God, that hit different. But I had to tell you how I feel. I couldn't hide it from you any longer. Oh my God. <sighs> I feel so free now. You're very special to me. Of course, because of my situation, I can't let anyone know about this. Mitsuru seems to trust you. The relationship with Mitsuru has intensified. Oh my god. Empress Mitsuru Kirijo. Just one more. The Mitsuru Kirijo social link has reached level 9. Your power to create personas the Empress Arcana has grown. Your relationship has grown stronger. Mitsuru. From now on, I'll only call you by your first name when we're together. It may feel a little awkward, but that's what I want to do. I no longer feel shackled by my family name. I met you because of who I am. Me true. Take good care of me. I will. Stay with me just a little while longer. The hours flew by as you talk with Mitsuru. After school, evening. Oh, hey! Hey! Ah, oh, not in the mood for walkies. All right, let's. Yeah, let's go to our room and sleep. A bit early, yes. It's Friday. Oh, we're getting people in 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 Tartarus. Good morning. This is Elizabeth. I'm calling to inform you that another human has strayed into Tartarus. Two this time, I believe. Please don't delay in carrying out your rescue. Goodbye now. The call ended. Mm. Okay. Finally, time for lunch. Who's coming up? Um, Michiru-kun? I was wondering if I could talk to you sometime. I have something important to tell you. When? Whenever you have time is fine. Well, I'll see you later. This Fuka has something to talk to you about. Okay, so we can progress with Fuka. Maybe you should go see her after school. Hmm. Hello, Michiru-san. Are you available after school? For now? I see. Would you be interested in walking home together? I want to be beside you. Seems I guess would like to spend some time with you after school. You may wish to talk to her once classes are over. Alright. <coughs> Lunch break is almost over. You decide to return to your classroom. Okay. <laughs> Finally on September 24th, the Satsuma Rebellion ended. This marked the end. The end of the age. Of the samurai. We're going to skip the next chapter and go back to the Sengoku era. There's so much more to cover. Well, modern history? You guys are still juniors. I have plenty of time to learn modern history when you're seniors. People talk about the end of the world, but don't worry. It'll still be another school year. Come on, haven't you paid attention? Look how long this country has survived so far. I feel tired. Close your eyes for a few minutes. Now... Anyways, let's start with the Kamakura era. So, how did the Kamakura Shogunate come about? Well, I'll tell you. They stayed up and listened to the lecture. Academics has increased. Class is ended for today. Spend some time with Aegis. We have so little time left. Um, Michiru-san. I want to be by your side. I guess it's looking directly into your eyes. Since you have the Aeon Persona Uriel, you might be able to become even closer. Would you like to spend some time with Aegis after school? Yes. Thank you very much. Shall we go? Aegis seems happy. I was gonna end it like this morning, but I got requests after I got people in Tartar, so. In front of the Iwata Ice Station. As you arrive, well, I guess you feel a threatening presence. What? 
<clears throat> oh. We've suddenly been surrounded by stray dogs. They seem angry. Oh, boy. You're the ones that I often see at the shrine. What is the matter? Argus began talking with the dogs. Huh? Koro Marusan. We did that? Wait. Aren't... We aren't mistreating Koro Marusan? It's true that he's helping us in our battle, however. The dogs drew closer to Igis. No. Uh. Oh, right. Um, these dogs are Koromaru-san's old friend. Friends. They doubt our intentions regarding Koromaru-san since he has been more frequently injured lately. How can we make them understand? Uh, just try explaining. This is all a misunderstanding, everyone. <sighs> they don't seem to want to listen. Please, don't be angry. Calm down. I can stretch out her hand to one of the dogs. Oh. I guess seems to have been bitten by a dog. But it yelped. Oh. I am so sorry, my hand is hard. The dogs ran away. I see. No wonder they doubt me. They are confused since my body is not natural. I hope that dog isn't hurt. I have been thinking lately. Although my heart may become more human, my body will forever be mechanical. Of course, that's how I was designed. But I am not strong enough to be a weapon, and I'm too rigid to pass as a human. I'm neither fish nor fowl, not completely machine nor human. That's not true. But... <clears throat> oh... I'm sorry, Michiru-san. Thank you very much. You're right. Even if I can't quite explain it, I have to be true to myself. <laughs> I guess has a painful smile on her face. I'm sorry for saying such things. If I hadn't been created, I would never have met everyone, and that includes you. If I can stay by your side, then nothing should faze me. You sense faint affection from Igis. Rank 3. We're, doing, we're going pretty good at a good pace. Igis Social Link has reached level 3. Your power to create personas the Aeon Arcana has grown. Have to calculate. I should make sure that the dogs understand our situation. It would be bad if you were placed in danger again. I'll see you later. Excuse me. Parted with Igis and went back to the dorm. Okay. Welcome back. Thank you. Um, let's go to Tartarus tonight. It's been a while since I've suggested we should go. Ever since I was at the lab, I've been so confused. But I'm not confused anymore. I want to fight with you. Yes, let's do that. I think that TARDIS is a little unstable today. Accidents might be more frequent because of this. Watch out. Oh, it'll be cheaper to use the clock to recover today too. Oh, it's a stroke of luck. And let's go to Tartarus. Okay, I'll tell the others. I'll be waiting at Tartarus around midnight. See you there. Okay. All right. Let's make our party, I guess. I'll show you what I'm made of. Yukari? All right. Let's go. And Mitsuru. <laughs> I'll try to meet your expectations. Oh, 
Paragrim door. Okay, I guess that's, uh, yeah. 220 and 226. All right, let's uh, not fuse personas. Uh, check request. Anything? 53 and 54, might as well. Ooh, defeat the Reaper. We might as well try it. We don't have many more. We have the Reaper and that. Might as well take it just in case there is no deadline, but I suggest you not take too long to complete it. Okay. And this. And that is all. We still have more requests missing, apparently, but. Let's, uh. Boop. Alright. There we go. We are fine. Alright. But. I'm going to leave this episode here and I will go until I reach a boss. I don't know how far I have to climb, but it's going to be the same one as the last Charteris episode. So hope you guys have been enjoying these videos. If you have, please leave a like, comment and share. That always helps out against that pesky YouTube algorithm. Subscribe to join the Moonlight Army today. Hit that bell icon to be notified when I upload a new video. If you guys want to stalk me on my social medias, the links will be in the description box below. And hope you guys enjoyed the long video. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.